The doors at Macy's stores across the country opened at midnight. Bargain hunters raced to be the first to snag the very best deals. Some retails opened even earlier, 8 or 9 p.m. last night, despite the holiday. Want to bring in Macy's CEO Terry Lundgren. He's standing outside the Macy's flagship store in New York uh, in Herald Square. Terry, good morning. Great to see you. Happy holidays. Good morning, Alina. Happy Thanksgiving. Yeah, and congratulations on a, a beautiful, beautiful parade yesterday. Just spectacular and perfect weather. Uh, meanwhile, um, as I just said, the doors opened uh, at Macy's at midnight. How's it going so far? So far, it's going great. You know, I'm, I've, I have, have a personal commitment that I've had for all of my career to be here at the opening of our, of our stores on uh, Black Friday. And so, of course, I was here at 1130 uh, last night, and uh, it was a record crowd at Herald Square. And uh, it was great to stand in front of the door and just watch this stream of humanity coming through <laughs> our doors. And I was there for 18 minutes, and it didn't stop. It just kept coming and coming and coming. So, it, it, you know, to me... This is uh, just, uh, just, just a great day. I mean, I, how, what else can I say? You know, I want to bring up some numbers here. Um, and as you know, many retailers uh, moved, their, moved up their sale hours um, to Thanksgiving, 8, 9 p.m. in some cases. You did not decide to do that. Um, you know, if, if you look at the numbers, um, yesterday alone uh, on Thanksgiving Day, really incredible, 41 million people across the country uh, went out to shop. Black Friday, 80.5 million are expected. Uh, but you can't ignore that 41 million. I mean, would you ever consider um, um, moving moving the time up, uh, Terry, maybe next year? You know, it's it's not in the cards for me. I mean, I'm, I'm sure I'll get pressure. I never want to say never. <laughs> but at this point, I think we've got the right strategy. We, had, we do something that other retailers don't do. It's called the Macy Thanksgiving Day Parade. <laughs> so my employees are very busy on Thanksgiving because most of what you see out there on the streets is volunteers from Macy's, including myself. I'm out there. And so, frankly, I want a little bit of a break before I leave the parade and just go right to work. So I'd like to have a Thanksgiving dinner, as my employees would like to have their Thanksgiving dinner before we show up for work at midnight. Do you care to offer a prediction on, on holiday sales? I mean, is, is, is today um, and, and yesterday, well, I guess midnight, you open at midnight. So is today, um, it, 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 is it going well so far? And do you think it's going to be a strong holiday season for Macy's? I do. I mean, we've had 11 quarters of just fantastic growth in sales and in earnings, and, and I suspect that's going to continue in the fourth quarter. And we already said we're going to be up over 4% in the fourth quarter. We were up over 5% last year and up over 4% the year before. So we've just got a track record of success, but particularly around the fourth quarter. I mean, customers are choosing us for to give a gift. Uh, and so, so we, we suspect that that pattern will uh, continue, and uh, we feel really good about it. I think now November, it's going to be more challenging for stores like our, ourselves who had 200 stores closed for the first few days of the, of the period due to Hurricane uh, Sandy, of course. Uh, but I think that today is going to be big. And then, of course, uh, December has got an unusual calendar. This is, this, is the, the, this is the unusual calendar where we have more days between Thanksgiving and Christmas than in any other calendar period of any year. Uh, and that's good overall, but it means that it'll be slow at the beginning, and it'll be, you know, last minute will be very, very powerful. So the week before Christmas uh, will, will, will be a big rush. Uh, and we suspect you won't know how you're doing until you get to that week before That's Christmas. That's right, because people like me wait till that week to shop. <laughs> Terry Lundgren, uh, I, I wish you the very best this holiday season and my best to your family.